Hey everyone, how's it going? So, uh, I have been asked several times to actually hook a true 1500 watt heater up to this inverter to see what it'll handle and for how long. Now, I have made some brief um, 1500 to 2000 watt draws on this very briefly out of this outlet without issue. But again, that's a brief thing, okay? Right now, I have this heater running. This is a 1500 watt heater and you can see that I've got it on the 1500 watt setting. The alarm light is on. It's not beeping. The alarm light is just on. And there's no heat coming out of it at all. There's a lot of heat obviously here. No heat coming out of this at all. And I've had this running for about five minutes. And one of the common complaints that I've seen beginning on the video that I posted of this particular inverter is somebody plugging in something like a 1500 watt heater and after about a minute or so it turns off there is a safety on here that if the uh, the inside of the inverter gets too hot then it'll actually shut down but as I said there's there's no heat whatsoever coming out of this the alarm light is on it's not beeping but I'm not having any issues at all it's not hot I, I you know that's probably been I say four minutes now that this thing has been running and it's putting out a lot of heat it really is hot um, but uh, so yeah I don't seem to be having the problems that a lot of other people are having I don't know why I don't know if I just got lucky with my inverter or whatever I have noticed some comments some people making um, you know hooking it up to 240 volts and still you know faulting out after 2000 watts or so but I don't know. I'm more worried about my batteries not being able to handle this kind of draw. So, um, yeah, I don't seem to be having any issues at all. No beeps, just the alarm light is on. So, I don't know. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and turn it down to 1250. And you can see that the alarm light went off. I switched it down to 1250. It's still putting out a lot of heat. But, um, yeah, so anyway, this is a thermostat control um space heater and i really like it because uh it's you know obviously got this thermostat in it where i can turn it down to a certain temperature if i wanted to you know it's not perfect it doesn't have like numbers or anything but i don't care so i can actually keep this thing running um you know at night if i get the battery bank for it which i quite honestly don't at this point but anyways um so yeah i just wanted to um kind of uh, I guess show you that it does in fact work just fine and I'm really concerned because there's a lot of people who are complaining about these inverters going bad after you know a 1500 watt draw or so on out of this this outlet here but again I'm not really sure um, I couldn't tell you to be honest but uh, yeah I'm not having any problems at all with the setup and just so you're curious this I just got this and this shunt here these are 100 amp shunts and 100 amp meter because I pegged out my meter um, here a couple days back when I was putting out uh, about 56 amps so that thing that shunt up there was getting red hot so I got this I'm gonna install that actually right now but anyway I just uh, thought I would uh, kinda get that video going to show you that I'm not really having any problems with my inverter right now at this point so we'll see only time will tell i guess but yeah i mean it, there's it's not even not even warm not even warm to the touch it's cool so all right guys um take care